A candidate backed by Prime Minister Shinzo Abe won Sunday's election for governor of Tokyo, frustrating a rival's effort to make the vote a referendum on the Japanese leader's pro-nuclear energy policy nearly three years after the Fukushima disaster. The ballot was widely seen as a test for Japan's public opinion on atomic power in a nation shaken by the Fukushima nuclear disaster. Dennis Liu reports from Tokyo, Japan. Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe's favorite candidate won Sunday's election for governor of Tokyo in what has been widely by his opponents as a referendum on Abe's pro-nuclear energy policy nearly three years after the Fukushima disaster. Masuzoe downplayed the nuclear referendum concentrating as he had on the election campaign on welfare and the 2020 Tokyo Olympics. The widely expected victory by former Health Minister Yoichi Masuzoe comes as a relief for Abe, who had suffered a rare setback in another local election last month. Abe said he was happy to work with the new governor on the Tokyo Olympics. Masuzoe, 65, backed by Abe's Liberal Democratic Party, won by a wide margin, polling numbers showed. Masuzoe had not made energy policy a prime focus, although he said Japan should reduce its dependence on nuclear power in the medium to long term. Public support for nuclear technology has waned since a tsunami caused a disaster at Fukushima in March 2011. And the opposition had hoped to make this vote a referendum on the Prime Minister's pro-energy stance. But surveys are showing that despite nuclear fears, voters believe that energy policy is not as important an issue as jobs and the economy.